Hi, I'm Ming Doyle, and today I'm working on an America Chavez piece. I went to art school and got a BFA in painting and studio drawing. I lived at home with my parents for two years after graduating from college. I just was like drawing a lot of fan art and posting it to my live journal because this was 2008. And I just clawed my way into the industry from there. <laughs> When I'm preparing to draw a superhero like America, she's a really fun character to do because she is a tough teen. And I really like her attitude and I'll be sneering or I'll be laughing or I'll be yelling or whatever. And then just thinking back into my own far, far distant past when I was a teen as well. And the kind of attitudinous lip that I would give to people. It helps it be more engaging for you to put what you're feeling on the page, I think. I think it is an amazing time for comics right now. We're having a huge explosion of diversity in terms of the characters and thankfully the creators. Superhero comics are expanding to kind of incorporate more of these genres that have been missing for so long. Of course, there have always been really strong female characters in comics, but I feel like there's so much more of a hunger in the audience for reading these stories. And I'm just so happy that publishers are taking notice and providing that material. And people always ask me, you know, how, how do you get into comics? And I think the easiest answer is just to start making them and posting them. There's so many different ways to tell a story. You know, if you do what you want to do and you have a voice that people are interested in hearing, then you are going to find a place in the community. When I'm drawing someone like America, I'm definitely just punching it all into smithereens star-shaped smithereens. <laughs>